graphic extras. In this video I'm going to show you how you can uh, use Photoshop CC 2014 custom shapes and create a design and remove like make holes in the design so if you sort of get a mottling effect for a custom shape. Uh, I'm going to be using an arc shape uh, now this one is from a graphic extras you can find that on the graphic extras website so initially apply and I'm just going to apply it as a new layer use its shape and I'm going to go with black just so it's you can see it so here's the initial design. Okay, once I've got that, I can now go to, just gonna use ellipse tool. And I'm gonna set it initially to combine shape. And I'm just gonna create it, mainly because if you do it the other way around, if you actually go straight away and use subtract, it actually inverts the uh, original design. So just created that there. Now go to subtract and it subtracts from the original design. So, okay, now you can continue. You can, any, anything else you apply, you can actually just quickly apply additional holes. Of course, you can chop away the actual edge. I'm just gonna, of course, create little, uh, tiny little holes around the edge. So it's cutting away from the original design. And you can still, of course, delete them if you wish. You can say, oh, I don't want that, but I can, Put that one there, and so I just quickly cut away there, all the way through that design. Once you've actually done that, you can, of course, just turn around and go to edit, and you think, ah, oh, can't do that. What I need to do, select using the direct selection tool, and now you can say define custom shape. And there you have the actual design. So once I've done that, I can remove that now. I'm going to remove the whole lot. Just go back to the start. It's the quickest, easiest way. Go down here, custom shape tool. And there's that new shape design with all the sort of pass cut out of the original. So an interesting, more interesting design perhaps than the original design. Hope you found this quick tutorial of interest. Thank you much.